Hello everyone. So in the previous lectures, we have seen about equal to, not equal to, greater than or equal to, less than or equal to instruction. And in this session, we will be seeing about greater than as well as less than instruction. So whenever the value, uh, whenever we are comparing two values, whenever one value is greater than another value, the output will be in the high state. Okay. So this is what greater than and similarly less than when the first value is less than the another value, then the output will be in the high state so we will be seeing both the instructions in this today's lecture right so let us see how to use it making the logic again will be requiring what these two instructions are required okay so the first instruction is our compare instruction that is greater than okay and he'll here what we'll do is i'll take one n now and then we'll be using one counter instruction so let us use this box now okay now again we'll be using the same box okay here we don't require this box actually uh, we need to make it as a comparator right so here we'll be using this one and then we'll be using an output right so our logic is ready and here we'll be requiring ctu that is up counter okay now what are the text required the same text whatever we have taken in the previous lecture so what are the text input pulses L uh, reset and uh, this uh, md0 that is memory double word is required in order to change the values or to pass the values to the comparator and an output is required so let us make all the text so what are the text required so the first tag required is input pulse right input underscore pulse right and the similarly will be requiring a reset tag reset tag okay and then we'll be requiring an led okay so here what i'll do is i'll give it as q0.0 and then we'll be requiring a uh, current value of the counter right current value okay so writing it as value right and what will be the data type uh, here it will be memory double word right so i am giving it as M md0 right this is our memory double word okay and this will become what will this become this is double word right so basically double integer is required or double word is required here okay so in this way we have taken all the text now and this is our led written okay now let us observe here we'll be giving an input pulse okay so i am giving it as input pulse okay and this is our reset so here we'll be giving a reset okay and here we are giving a preset value of zero let us take it as zero and here what i'll give uh, we'll be giving the address of memory double word okay because this value has to be passed to this comparator so we'll be giving it using this comparator uh, this address md0 so the same value will be passed to the comparator so current value of the uh, counter is passed to the comparator using md0 so md0 will be the address here also and now here here if you are able to observe this is asking for a data type that is why it is in the red color so let me uh, give a data type here what is the data type double int will be required and this will be suppose we are giving it as 5 right so now we will be giving an address q0.0 as an output and i will download this i will download this right after downloading it will be going in the online mode okay okay after going to online mode i will be going in the monitor mode okay this is our monitor mode so let me reset all the requirements here let me reset all the tags first okay and uh, here if you are able to observe this is our what greater than uh, greater than instruction right so whenever this current value is greater than 5 then only the output will be in the high state but now initially the current value is not greater than 5 that's why the output is in the low state so let us increase the value of this current value by giving the pulses to the counter okay so i am giving the first pulse okay 
giving the next pulse in this way the value of current value of the counter is increasing one by one okay so whenever it will be uh, greater than five right so when this current value is greater than five then only the output will be in the high state so e even if it is equal to five then also the output will be in the low state so if you are able to observe i am giving the fourth pulse and this is the fifth pulse now still the output is in the low state okay so when this value will become greater so i am giving the next pulse now okay now this is the sixth pulse and the output is in the high state so in this way what is happening whenever we are giving the pulses and when the value is greater than this current value is greater than the five okay so whatever preset value will be setting okay accordingly it will be here right so this is how we are using this greater than instruction similarly we'll be seeing the less than instruction now okay so what i'll do is i'll just change the instruction from here itself okay i'll change it as less than okay so in this way we have to change the address now let us observe so what is going to happen in this because the value current value is less than 5 obviously at initially still initial state it will be less than that's why the output will be in the high state so initially itself the output will be in the high state so let us download this okay after downloading let us go to the on uh, online mode right okay after going to online mode let me go to the monitor mode from here and why because this is in the low state because of uh, because we are not reset right so the previous comparison is taking place uh, let me reset it once okay so again the values now are in the zero state so if you are able to observe this current value is less than this five value that's why the output is in the high state right so until and unless the value of current value of the counter is less than 5 okay the output will be in the high state okay so let us observe i will be giving the pulses now i am increasing the number of pulses and accordingly what will happen now when this value okay uh, this value this current value will be less than 5 then only the output will be in the low state see if you are uh, this this uh, current value is less than 5 that is the output is in the high state right so that is why the output is in the high state now again i am giving the next pulse okay so it is in the low state because now it has become equal to that is the current value is equal to 5 that's why it is not not less than this current value is now net not less than 5 that's why the output is in the low state okay so this is why we are using this this is how we are using this less than instruction so the next uh, session will be regarding the remaining instructions okay so uh, both the instructions are covered in this lecture so the in the next lecture we'll be seeing about in range and out range instructions okay